Hello, everybody. We're the oh, primitives. Welcome to die. <laughs> welcome to die. <laughs> welcome to die. <laughs> oh, wait, I had that reform option too, didn't I? You can I still that. reform. You're just gonna be tinier. Now, if you get yourself vassal, that might be a little harder. Although, if you are a subject, you do not get doom ticking up. Well, that'll help me. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, well, when I come up there and make you a vassal and we make you... <laughs> Wait, I just explored the Ivory Coast. Come on, show me... Oh, it won't show me uh, Cape Verde. I was able to yeah. uh, explore the Ivory Coast, but it won't show it to me. That's part of a different note, I guess. I don't know. It shouldn't be, though. I think that's Ivory Coast. What else could it be? I mean, I, I, I could put it in Brazil, maybe, but... That'd be a little odd. Nah, uh, it's Ivory Coast. It's red like that. Yeah, okay. 30 rebels, huh? Yeah, yeah about that. Bye. Bye. Hey, Congo. How would you like to get squished? I'd almost like to camp this war so I can take at least a tech two because Aztec's already tech three. Kalima's tech three. <laughs> I'm still tech one, and that has made my wars a little more difficult than in my test games, to say the least. Mm -hmm. Can I'm I still win? Yeah. I'm almost tech four in military. Yeah. See, it's ridiculous. <laughs> that makes a difference. I I am. Ridiculous. Yeah, yeah, I would say it makes a difference. How are you doing in admin tech? Um, I could go to to three, but I'm I'm just holding out until after the war. Then I'm going to three, so I'll be three, two, four soon. Yeah. See, this is uh, th this is the benefit of having a, a good roller at the start as a native nation versus having not for a while. Yeah. Because my starting roller is a four two four, but then he died, and I got stuck with a a one five zero regency for too long. It just hurts. It hurts so much. And I got the teeth monster, so I better stop this. <laughs> I Where always thought it was like a fleet? ship. I always thought oh, there it was you a are. ship. <laughs> <laughs> Told my fleet to go somewhere, and it just kind of like disappeared. Yeah, Aztec, you're going down to OPM status. Screw you. <laughs> we shall squish you. All right, mostly sieged. This will cause the other two to go free. Uh, export licenses or no. I really don't want uh, 20 legitimacy. I already got, I'm already down by three. Eh. All right, so I got everything now except for Quito in the last one. Quito. Nice. Thefting the islands. Man, everyone's going to the Port Independence. <laughs> My fingers crossed here. Can I do it? Can I do it? Yes, Can I managed to kill 500 natives. <laughs> A whole 500. <laughs> That's oh, what man. bankruptcy does That's to pretty you. impressive. Yeah. That's what bankruptcy does to you. Oh, and I took out that daimyo, and I was uh, bankrupt. That was amazing. <laughs> Tack had it declared on me, and I just, like, piled crap on it. <laughs> had no morale. <laughs> yeah, if you can one-shot it. No, so I had to fight him. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's not good. It was, uh, it was a very interesting war, considering the kind of war it was. <laughs> that was that close. It was a good start to the game, anyway. Oh, okay. <laughs> All went yeah. downhill from there, but it was a good start. Yeah, the Sun are doing well up there. That's good. Yep, the 
doom rays and attack costs. That's alright, I'll sacrifice one of my vassals before hitting the reform button. So I take uh, attack with no doom at all. Oh, nice. So, that's gotta be a bug. What? Maybe I should just erase the footage. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the more colonial maintenance that I pay while I'm bankrupt, the less settlers I have. But oh, that's been around a while. Let's same thing. Same thing goes that. if I if I go negative, it still oh, goes I, negative. That's, that's crazy. Okay. Yeah, if you leave it at exactly zero, you can still colonize. All I want is zero. <laughs> why did I, Why did I lose thirty authority? I was at a hundred when I was uh, at if war. You raise, uh, if you raise autonomy, you do lose authority. Just so you know. Okay. You did not know. Did not know that at all. It doesn't even say that in the tooltip. No, it doesn't. Oh my god. <laughs> I was so ready for for that. Okay. Just nice and solid. Of course not. <laughs> Although the more packs you get, the more authority you get over time. So I think the optimal strategy for them is just to spam expand as hard as you can possibly do it. What? Oh, I can't lower autonomy anymore. I'm losing my boats. I'm losing my boats there. Well, it is increasing by 3.9 at the moment. I was so ready to do a reform, and now I can't. Ah, that sucks. I was ready to do a reform, too. Me, too. Or about anything. <laughs> Have you been buying, like, the ideas and stuff? Me? Yeah. The native ideas? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, just making sure. Ninety percent to force religion, or make him just be a vassal, or I can always just constantly full annex and pop him out as a vassal. Yeah, so you don't level. have the tech lead anymore. You know what now? Oh, I'm finally not tech one against two or three. I'm tech ah. two in military. <laughs> it's a very uh, important point for me, actually. It is let me get massacred a little bit less. Alright, never mind this. There you go, guy. You are now Norse. I can vassal him again later. Not really gonna change much. Gives him fifteen years to uh <laughs> Oh, Congo is no longer a valid rival. Good for you. You beat your rival. You're not allowed to rival them anymore. Hey, look, Congo is a valid rival. Ugh. <laughs> I get that with the Mayans lot over here. Not this particular playthrough. This one's been crazy, but more normally. Like my test runs. Mm. I don't go bankrupt in my test runs. No. <laughs> I don't really? declare on people who outnumber me like two to one in our higher technology in my test runs either. <laughs> that really hurt. Yeah, that's just for it, fun. it doesn't look like it's going to slow me down much, oddly, but it, <laughs> it hurt. Ooh, that was close. Taking a th out a thousand natives is a much closer battle. Yeah, those guys are rough. They play nice. Yep. Will I actually like me? Yeah, they're down at four percent. <laughs> Liberty desire. They don't quite have trust though. I wonder why. What? Is Doom getting reduced? Holy cow! What the hell? 
Yeah, I have 18 provinces, and with uh, three reforms passed, is it three reforms? Yeah, three reforms passed, I have uh, minus 10 doom. This looks like it might go clean up to a hundred or very close, and when you pass five. Mm. Wow, that's uh... They really big bust this religion. <laughs> it's double impact. Yeah, I get to keep more. Yeah. And it doesn't hurt as much. It looks like when you have five reforms passed, you can just go crazy. Well, I'm gonna reform all five pretty quickly, I think, at this point. What are you up to now? I haven't reformed anything. But I got all the provinces soon, so it's gonna go quick. No. And I don't get any uh, any events anymore. Oh, I'm out oh, of sync. I'm out of sync too. Uh, it said paused by paradox. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. Um, I shall uh, save again. Recording. Oh yeah, pause, pause recording. Support. See you guys in a bit. Yeah. <laughs> We're back. So world. World at large. Josh. Still has lots. I lost a lot. Yeah, but you still have a lot. Yeah? Yeah. And they got zero morale. Uh, I'll be back, don't worry. Looks like the meme team's doing just fine. Yeah. I'm on pace. Two and two is two. Cusco is big. But still waiting for reforms to happen. See what happens after that. Yeah. Uh, and so, as Josh was mentioning, apparently there was an Iberian wedding. Go figure. Uh, still too early to tell what the Wartenberg is huge. <laughs> yep. I just looked over there. It's like, wow. oh yeah, you're right. And uh, big. Burgundy is still around. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, they still have time to break it. Yeah, I think yeah, it's still they... getting inherited. Yep. Like Ming I... isn't going to last much longer by the looks. I could switch over to Burgundy and then they won't get inherited. They might go bankrupt, but they won't get inherited. <laughs> yeah. Uh, of course, <laughs> I'm still dead here. Doing my own stuff. Uh, the Portuguese have the cape and the... Uh, not cape. But I already knew that. But they haven't jumped into South America yet. Cabrete. No South American presence for them just yet. Yeah, we'll be there soon. That far. All right, looks interesting. Ming is completely covered with rebels. Yeah, they're they're gonna shatter. They're gonna shatter really badly, yeah. as often happens. If you don't pick a uh, Jewish Western nation in Australia and then let them Westernize, eh. yeah. <laughs> and after which they are temporarily the largest military in the world by a yeah. margin. <laughs> Other than that situation. You know, other than that one. Whoops. Yeah, I, well, I think that has something to do with the fact that we're playing on normal rather than hard. Yeah. Oh, the but, Rebels, you think? Yeah. Yeah, because on hard, they wouldn't break that bad. AIs, unless you give them bonuses. I thought that didn't matter. No, I'm pretty sure on hard, they are, they're more aggressive about st certain things, and they'll take out the Rebels a bit faster. Yeah. Or something. I don't know. So. Is Shall everyone ready? Continue. I'm ready. I'm yep. ready. Okay, 11 more minutes to go. Alright, Kilwa. We shall marry. Maybe. Yeah, no aggressive expansion, doesn't matter. Lose one stability or a little bit of cash. Eh. Oh. The whole Smalley area is kind of under siege <laughs> by everybody. In September I'll uh, get another 11 base tax from the two vassals that I'm currently integrating. Uh, nice. That should help a little bit with uh, the authority. It's currently 4.0. Yeah, what is your authority based on? Is it just base based tax. around... Uh, base yeah, okay. base tax, not raising autonomy in events, basically. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I, th I knew about two of them, but not the uh, raising the 
autonomy. So I'm gonna get rebels uh, pretty soon. You got me through some hard times, General. Yes, and I just randomly declared war on pretty much the entire Smalley Coast. <laughs> like, yes, all of you can be in the war. Oh, including Yemen, for some strange reason. Oops. Oh, well. Ooh, oh, no, you're I'm up at six I'm now in three. Scheduled to hit four in the late 14, well, mid 1490s, but it'll, in practice it'll probably be late 1490s, because I'm in a core of it yet. That's good. Because as soon as that happens, I can get through um, at least Exploration Ideas 4 and go find my way into Brazil. And so I'll mm. be able to start Westernization in the 1500s, early 1500s. Like, before 1510, I'll start it. I'll finish it before 1520 at this rate. Unless something goes very unexpected now. Yeah, the, the doom ticking up more slowly with reform pass being buffed to this extent, it makes this a lot more seamless. Maybe claims the finish. Alright, doom goes up by 4.3 at this point. Oh, manpower recovery is just over here. I should probably find out how big of an army these guys have before I declare war on all of them at the same time. Might be useful. Pretty sure I'm stronger than all of them anyways. But, you know. Most likely. Subjects uh -huh. of high liberty uh -huh. desire. <laughs> I wondered if it has something to do with 158 aggressive expansion. No. <laughs> or 195 on uh, Klopnik. Well, for some reason, my aggressive expansion with Quito, the last remaining one, is only four. And I've taken out everything. That is a bit weird. I guess it's better to do a conquest war on these guys because I don't think I can get through. Should have checked if they were allied to anyone. No, I kind of wish they were in this case. The only ones that likes me is Keto. All my vassals hate me. I wonder why. <laughs> what did you I ever do to them? Mm. I don't know. Oh yeah, their aggressive expansion is a lot higher. Who cares? They're vassals. Whatever. Yeah. Stupid vassals. So I got one floating. Uh, what are they? What are they called? Floating tribes. You call them that? Should I take the, Should I take it out? Mm, yeah, it's free well, land. I can't get a CB. Uh, I think it has to be next to me. Well, they'll get there eventually. Please come over here and die. Aztec immediately go for Glaxcala again. I'll tell you what. Oh, I don't have a truce piece? Oh, I do, but it's a uh, five year. Hmm. It's me the most over any. Looks like Clapback is the one. No, don't run away. Stick around. 
Your fleet needs to go squeesh. Oh, and it crashed. Oh man, we can't uh, can't catch a break here, huh? Yeah. No, nope. stop the recording again. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it stopped it for me. Oh, okay. And we're back. Another crash. <laughs> yeah. But that's okay. Not the good kind of difficulty. Yeah. It's good fake difficulty. <laughs> the new <laughs> fake difficulty. Can you even play the game? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're doing too well. Got a crash. Old Nintendo ones, man. Certain old Nintendo games were <laughs> pretty much the same thing. Yay! I have refused or er, refused. <laughs> I have refused religious unity yet again. Nice. Or not. <laughs> we don't want your unity. All right, let's nice break alliance the with these guys. What is the Cape Coast? Dissolve. Don't I have Cape Coast? I'll take it. It's only minus eight. Ah, come on, I want a lower autonomy. I want my people to have freedom. Screw that. Okay, I have two vassals. I think colonists have to come next. Oh, did Azeron just get too big? No, okay, 97%. <laughs> I was gonna vassal them, and then they just chunked it, took a chunk of stuff. Like, if they get too big to eat, I would not be happy. Yeah, it would be annoying. <sighs> Authority 84. Much, they're done their war. Now they're gonna come back and be a pain. I've had a theologian, but I messed around too long and forgot about him. Can't understand what might have been on my mind that made me forget about him. <laughs> yeah, so you oh, waited too long on that one. Oh, they will give me access. Oh. I was not expecting you to give me access. They hate me. Like, minus 200 with 130 AE hate me. Yeah, and I'm fabricating claim on them currently. Are they like freaked out to hate you or just? They are outraged. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I would say they're reasonably freaked as well. They, I guess really they just also you. don't like my enemy, so they're willing to yeah. do it. I'm thinking about getting a plus. Losing this battle. Plus two advisor instead. Oh, I don't have any. Never mind. Oh, that did not go swimmingly. Please give me an event. I'll take anything, just give me authority. That's the only thing I need. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm really not seeing many events. It's nope. weird. I think they've nerfed it. Nah, I mean, you guys probably have less events, just generally. Well, I did not have that in my test run. Oh, there's a little bit of event here, yeah. but that doesn't really matter. Lose money, okay. No um, authority events. I think I've had two so far. Mm. Weird. Yeah. Watch, well, it's just one of those things where we load up, uh, no, we just did load up a save. I was going to say we load up a <laughs> save and then you get like millions of events all at once that you didn't, weren't getting before. <laughs> huh. Nope. I had that nope. happen with westernization once, it was pretty ballsy. Well, there could be something with 1.11 from, at least for me, yeah. because it's a custom nation thing. Yeah, that Maybe could be. Well, change, then. I'm still getting events as a custom nation. Maybe not like mass spam of them, but still getting some. Yeah, I've I've had a few. I just haven't had a lot. Oh, they canceled military access. Ah, oh, screw off. It's okay. They'll give it to your enemy now. 
No, I don't think they will. They hate my enemy. And if they gave it to my enemy, they'd let me through. So they're not going to yeah. do it, because that would, that would be too convenient to the player. Yeah, speaking of convenience... Sorry, I'm still going to win, though. Before I get the castle. Let's actually recall that before I forget. Uh, robots, very insistent that we are done. So, right. thanks for watching. See you guys next time. See you next time. Thanks for watching.